My name's Jeff and I'm in Music Industry Arts. Um, unlike a lot of candidates that come to Fanshawe, most people come straight out of uh, high school and they just know that they want to take Music Industry Arts. Um, me, I didn't actually find out about Music Industry Arts until I actually went through university and I actually found that I wanted to kind of streamline my specialties and uh, um, music industry arts was actually one of the only programs that was so renowned provincially. Like, uh, it's got huge critical acclaim. It's got great faculty, and uh, it's something that I really want to do. And I'm here today. So, um, coolest thing I would say is working with the teachers who have an active role still in the industry. Uh, a lot of them are still managing bands. A lot of them own record studios. Um, record labels even, and so I get to play with a lot of fancy toys and get lots of hands-on experience. In a typical class, uh, they're separated into lecture styles, so you can sit around and hear lots of stories from Terry McManus, which uh, a lot of you first years I'm sure you're going to find out very soon. Uh, it's, it's great. Um, and then there's also very lab-oriented classes where you get to hang around and uh, just get a lot of hands-on experience with uh, the studio gear, learn how to work it, uh, produce, songwriting, all sorts. Um, I am really impressed with the college and the program so far as far as the people are concerned. Uh, there's a great culture. Uh, you get into the program and you meet so many open-minded people. Um, I've, ne or I've been to London probably about twice in my life before I came here and I kind of just came on blind faith at the program uh, on its uh, credibility alone. And within the first few months, I already have a, a huge uh, social support network of great friends that I'm probably going to keep in touch with for the rest of my life. And um, the teachers make it so easy to want to come back, want to learn, and uh, they really make it clear that um, you know, just going through the program isn't enough. You have to really want to succeed in the industry, and I really like how they uh, foster that kind of culture where success is really, you know, dependent on your own shoulders. So, uh, it's very clean. A um, lot of uh, it's always, you know, the janitors are very friendly people. They're always, you know, hanging around. And uh, but uh, other other than that, the facilities are great. A uh, lot. Um, the Outback Shack is a great place to hang out. Uh, the pubs at Fourwell Hall are great. Um, and if drinking and socializing is your thing, there's um, you know, just a lot of uh, you know, activities and things going on. It's, it's a great place. Uh, any hopeful? Well, if uh, you're still in high school, you definitely want to make sure that your grades uh, stay up. Just because as of this year, uh, music industry arts is now no longer provincial, provincially um, provincial only uh, for applicants in Ontario. It's actually for applicants all across Canada. So just to show you how, um, how the reputation for the program has gone you know, beyond uh, the own borders of Ontario. Um, keep your grades up, uh, work hard once you get into music industry arts, um, dream a little, have, a, have some aspiration. Uh, it's definitely okay to have your head in the clouds uh, because everybody else in the program is going to as well.